accidentally overread by a couple chapters. I just was like turning the page, you know, how you just get carried away on the Kindle and you're just like, la, 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 la. Read, read, read. Oops, I finished the book. <laughs> Honestly, I was like, oh, mm. shoot. Ah, oh, shit. I need to find my Kindle. It's in airplane mode. It's not synced to my phone. Hold on. <laughs> 68% of the way through. That was a missed opportunity to read like one more percent. <laughs> it's probably just one page turn. <laughs> Honestly, it probably is. Damn it. I'm readier. 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 Ready, ready. Um, all right. So this is week two of Year of the Reaper. Mm hmm. Um, we did. We were supposed to do chapters ten through eighteen, nineteen. Maybe I overread more than I thought. <laughs> I thought Maybe I checked. I, I thought it was twenty-one. Was it twenty-one? Then I underread. I stopped at eighteen. <laughs> I love how we're just killing this. I have it somewhere. Hold on. Uh, shoot. It's really just a Thunderdome of a book club. Just read to any point that you choose. <laughs> Thunderdome. <laughs> uh, so... No rules, just right. Have it your way. Is that Subway or Burger King? It was 9... Just nine, nine, all of 9 to 21 or 10 to 21. However, we, d we established how I don't understand these things. So <laughs> 9, 10 to 21 or 18, somewhere in there. But um, I, I kind of like that book? this isn't like a hard and fast rigid book club because like sometimes <laughs> you're just existing in your own little world. But uh, yes, I, you know how we talked about last week that like, nothing felt forced all of chapter 10 felt like it was quickly happening like she was like for like kind of forcing the story along a line but it was just in chapter 10 and then it went back to being like normal again chapter 10 okay so remind me that was um because they'd already cut off that guy's hand in chapter 9, right? And then that was the statue one, right? Where they beat the shit out of the statue. I think so. And picked all their favorite weapons. Yeah, and then they and started... Then out that his favorite weapon is the picture on the book. Yeah. On the cover. Yep. <laughs> and you're like... <gasps> <laughs> Look! It all makes sense. When um, you close your Kindle and all of a sudden you're like, Oh, hey! <laughs> that's what a mace is! <laughs> Yeah, it's, uh, and it's also, like, during this, they start hitting the road to bring the royal family back to the capital. They hit the road already? Or they're just packing up? Making preparations? I think it, it probably ended on... Let me look at chapter 18. Hold on one second. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, it's not really a spoiler. We all knew they were going to leave at some point. Oh, yeah. I just want to make sure I don't, like, spoil anything that happens when they first hit the road. Because if you ended at 18 and I ended at 23, like, you know what I mean? Like, that's a lot of pages to, like, mop up. Yeah, there's a small gap in there. Um, So maybe this gets answered in chapter 19. But I feel like I don't really get the plot or like point of the book or like Cass's thing to accomplish in the book. I don't get what the point is. Yet. Okay. Yes. Like, I wanted to talk one. about that. Okay. So um, chapter 19 is where they leave. So they hit okay, the road. So, so <laughs> this close. Yeah. So I won't go into what we figure out. Anyways. Also, I fall in love with Cassia even more. Uh, in like chapter 22, it's a good chapter. It's like the sweetest, <laughs> the sweetest. 
Oh, okay, so I have, I, let me write this down. I gotta write this down. Because I want to go back to your comment, because I, Cass, okay. Um, I'll forget if I don't write it down. My brain is fried. Um, so, <laughs> the whole, like, what is the plot? What is the point, right? And so, I, yeah. I agree with you. Like, we know that there's somebody attacking the family, right? Mm -hmm. We do not understand, like, what it is. We know... Cassia is noticing, like, all of this stuff, and he seems to be the only person aggressively trying to protect the family, even though his brother has been their protector forever, for the past three years, and mm -hmm. I understand why his brother has issues now. But, like, I, there's something with his brother. Like, there's something. Something weird about it. Yeah, there's something weird about his brother. And I'm just like, what is all of this? Right? Yeah. So, I think, so I noticed that, like, because the archer, right? The archer was the last little thing that they're kind of, sort of, looking into, but. It doesn't seem like they're super aggressive about looking into that. Well, they're just kind of like wandering around like Well, they also um that painter was murdered, right? Oh, that's right. And then yeah. the lady was on the horse smiling and Cassia gave chase and then he got beat up. Mm. Because people are dumb. <laughs> yeah. Um, I still think it's Lena. I think Lena's the the female archer. You think it's Lena? I do. Why do you think that? That's crazy. It's crazy. <laughs> Once again, remember when I was like, I think Cassie is a reaper, and then it was just like this one little thing that I was like, it's because he wore all black. Um, and he can see dead people, and he can't be killed. <laughs> um. So she was dressed like a guy in the forest, right? When we meet her, doing, like, guy things. She doesn't, like, she feels like she can take care of herself and she doesn't really, like, need anybody to, like, escort her around. Um, and there was just this one little tiny part when Cassia was like, I see that archer. It looks like a woman. <laughs> well, I could see that then, 110%, because I had the same feeling, but when the... Uh, the painter died. Mm -hmm. Lena was standing there when he gave chase to the lady who was smiling on the horse. Maybe she's not working alone. I, I don't right. know. I'm not going to let it go. I'm not going to let it go. <laughs> <laughs> I just, like, I'm thinking, like, who could it be? And I really, I don't know if it could be... Um, because, like, the other people that it could be are Marin, Marin, Mira, Mira, uh, Mira. Uh, the best friend that supposedly died of the plague, right? And, but, like, mm. we didn't get that confirmed. And then there's that, there's that. So you don't think, you don't think she's dead? I don't know. Like, I could see it being, like, she's not dead. And, like... I also think it could be, like, um, like, okay, so, like, the king was engaged to that one lady, Lady R, I'm gonna call her, because I don't remember her name, because she's stupid, <laughs> and, um, like, I feel like she could, hi she, like, could have hired someone, but it doesn't make sense for the person to know all of these details about the coins, the wedding dress, like, all of that. Um, so it has to be somebody who is, like, related to the troop, tro troop, that, like, came with her. And they even go in and to say that, the people who went and got her and brought her back were mostly from the kingdom that we're in, not not the queen's own kingdom. So right. I wonder if there was like 
um, like some woman lost her husband in that and is like vindictive or something too but i just feel like that i'm just like i just want to i don't think i'd be satisfied with that plot line like i really need this to be like a banger of a like of a person <laughs> and a reason like you know what i mean like i need to be like <gasps> shocked like just just shock me to my core kind of thing yeah agreed um what was sorry i'm just looking through my notes oh okay so this was just a little tiny like aside that lena made where they were like walking through the city and she was like learning about stuff about the city and she goes oh i should have brought some parchment i need to write this down and to me i just kind of like sat there for a minute and i was like as a historian, is she allowed to go off of memory, or does Ooh. she have to, like, like, can she go home at the end of the day and be like, I think I remember, and then write that down, or is that, like, fibbing, and so she's got to, like, not write it down, or go back with parchment paper, or... That's that... not really pertinent to the story, it was just a tangent my mind went on. <laughs> I think that's a cool tangent, though, because, like, how was... If you think about how much of, like, our history, our own history and reality was, like, transcribed at a later point from somebody's memory, I mean, we could get in a whole philosophical debate about the <laughs> translation of the Bible, which we're not going to get into. Um, it's ancient aliens. Just kidding. <laughs> Just kidding. Unless somebody requests it, but... <laughs> <laughs> we could. Um, I think that is a very interesting tidbit to bring up because it's like should that be how it's done like it should it be like in real time like looking at this thing writing it down <laughs> i think yes but and how much of human history is just based on memory like it was definitely yellow and somebody else is like are you stupid it was red yeah and now we'll never know what color that flower was again we could get into a whole philosophical debate because there's like a recent study that was done talking about how, like, reality is a perception based on this person. Like, the apple could be green or red to different people. Like, it's not, it's not red until we apply that to it or whatever it is. Ooh, this is going to make my brain hurt. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I read it, didn't understand a lot of it because there was, like, some quantum physics involved and I was like this is fascinating I don't understand so much of it <laughs> this makes me feel like I don't understand anything which I don't so then I just was like I'm glad I read that don't know what I got from it I don't know shit about fuck <laughs> yelp <laughs> I also keep forgetting that cast is like 18 oh my god me too Yep, I do keep forgetting. Like, talk I, about a mature 18 year old. Like, I mean, I do believe being tortured and building a bridge will do that to you. Yeah. Yeah. Hard labor will make you more mature. Psych. Yes. Psych. <laughs> <laughs> I said it and then I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> That's not true. <laughs> um. Also, okay, so I think this is chapter 14, Lord Amador. Mm -hmm. I don't think he's a very important character, and I feel like they just mentioned him the one time. However, he is a frowner. He just isn't a very, like, smiley person. But he wears formal black robes with a stiff lace collar. Um, the entire effect had always brought to mind a reaper. I know. I think I highlighted that, too. I was like, <laughs> oh, we're finally talking about Reapers. Good, 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 good. Because I was like... And then they skittered right past it. <laughs> I know. I was like, what? What Are we going to build on this more? Like, are we building on this more? I don't know. That's one of those ones. I don't know. Again, yeah. I just... I'm not sure where, where any of this is going. Also... I really don't know. 
I don't know either. I'm very curious. That's why I, I, but I think that's what makes a good book at this point in like a book is like, you're so curious to understand what the heck's going to happen that you just want to keep consuming the book. So I do think that it is right. well done so far, but I really, like I said, I need the bangers to start coming out. Like I need the, <gasps> the audible gas Dude. where everyone in the room looks at you like, <laughs> is she all right? Is she okay? And you're like, not okay. I'm not okay. I'm okay, but I'm not okay. <laughs> like, I need those moments. Yes. A total other aside. Agreed. Um, all of the words that I have to look up, a lot of them are related to food. Spanish food. <laughs> <laughs> but when they said things cooked in a niece and a custard, I was like, also... Side note, I'm freaking obsessed with fig, okay? Um, I was like, I need to now... You don't like figs? Ew. I don't think so. Ew. I don't think so. I like figs, okay? And I was like, I need to find well, this you're recipe. You're going to have to like them both enough for both of them. <laughs> also, they... Sorry, I don't know what that was. I couldn't talk for a second. <laughs> um, they use the word... How do you phonetically fucking say this, though? Oh, pronunciation. Lammergeier. Lammergeier. Right? They oh, use... yeah, I didn't know what that was either. It's a fucking bearded vulture. It's a bird. It's a giant fucking <laughs> bird. <laughs> Uh, I guess I could have looked that up, but I've just been uh, moving forward under the assumption it was a cat. <laughs> <gasps> oh! Do you know they're not actually red? They're not actually red. They find red dirt and, like, put it on their feathers to look more terrifying. And do you know what they eat? They eat only bones. They eat only bones. Yeah. Well, I mean that it's that so makes... funny. I wonder, I wonder if my TikTok caught on that I kept seeing this word because literally a TikTok video came up about those things, and they're famous in Scotland, and they're considered the ones that like carry away sheep. <gasps> but they don't eat meat; they only eat bones, and then they like cover themselves in the reddest dirt they can find for aesthetics. Wild, huh? <sighs> I didn't even know what that word was. <laughs> you know so much about it, though. <laughs> anyway, so I'm a very visual person. <laughs> God, you're hilarious. <laughs> oh, this is why you're one of my favorite people. I swear it. I swear. This is like a very endearing I've thing never heard about of that you. Word day in my life. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Oh, let me go on. The oh, look at this picture. I know all about this creature. They're wild. Let me just let me just riz you with tism. <laughs> Like this is this is her superpower. This is her chizzy superpower. <laughs> like, oh, uh, I was just telling Pulling somebody like temptations, not so much. <laughs> I was just telling somebody about um about you and dog breeds. Oh yeah. I was like, my friend Kristen knows all of them. Like, she's like sees it and she's like, oh, that's a da 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 and they got this, this is their personality, like, it can be problematic because of this, and I'm just like, yes, that dog is a that dog. <laughs> like, <laughs> Bobby's like, that just looks like a good boy to me. <laughs> <It's a cat. laughs> uh, <laughs> yep. <laughs> What kind of stupid is this? <laughs> it's our kind of stupid. We own it now. <laughs> uh, that is hilarious and awesome. Okay. Um, <laughs> I don't have much more to say about the book because so many reasons, but mainly because I'm scared I'm going to divulge what has happened from 21 to 23 because there's a lot of really 
interesting shit that happens. So I'm mostly just nervous okay, about spoilers. Before we go. Yeah. One. <laughs> There's real cats in this book. <laughs> yes, there are lynxes. They're called lynx. <laughs> um, and Lena asks why they had why they were so big, and Cassia says like, "Oh, because giants used to live here." And my mind, if you guys haven't gotten enough insight yet to how my mind works, I went, "Oh my god, they're all little people." This is an entire story about like midgets. <laughs> Okay. okay, I can't. But now that I've left you with that small tidbit. <laughs> we'll see you next week. So there's just like the tiniest bit of insight. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. We have to figure out what chapter are we reading to. Oh, yeah. Okay, so. Rue? <laughs> <laughs> um, we should be reading 21 through 29. So stop at 30. Stop at 30. Got yes. It. Stop at 30. Now that we have well and established... we'll be talking about 18 through 30. <laughs> now that we have established the insight of the chaos that is us. Um, <laughs> can't wait to talk to you next week. Leave a comment below about your thoughts about whatever chapters you read. And your favorite, uh, your favorite uh, <laughs> quote from those chapters. And uh, I will stop at chapter 30 this week, and so will Kristen. Maybe. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> Bye, not next week. <laughs>